Ilbliss blames society for decline in rap music. I'm going in, breaking in. Look at all the money that we're bringing in. The CEO of Goretti Company, Ilbliss, has recently spoken with Heap TV on what he feels is responsible for the state of the Nigerian music industry. While chatting with Hip TV, we asked him what could be responsible for the decline in the content of rap music. I think, I think you just fall under some sort of pressure as an artist sometimes. You know, you need to make commercial records because you're trying to stay relevant, you're trying, you're trying to do shows, you know. So we, as the years go on, you continue to cut down on the sensibility, on the lyrical content, on the meaning, the thoughtfulness of your music, you know. But I dare say this, that, you know, as rappers, we are, we are expected to bring a lot of knowledge and a lot of wisdom to the table. But we can also sneak in our commercial songs as well. You know, so if you're a rapper, stay a rapper. You're not a, you're not, you're not a singer, so to speak. You know, so you should face your genre, find ways of expanding it and making it as colorful as the other genre without losing your soul. Ill bliss father add his opinion regarding the recent swathe of brand endorsements. Um, branding is a double-edged sword for me, as far as I'm concerned. Um, and the, the, it comes with the good and it comes with the bad. The good for me is this. Um, it puts more money in the artist's pockets. It gives them more leverage. They can leverage more. Let's say, for instance, a telco, a telecommunication company signs you, and then they have you all over their billboards, and then they, they're pushing your ringtones for you, you know, and then they're helping you, they're supporting you, basically bringing your brand up and, you know, basically making your brand go viral, which is something that, as an artist, you might not have been able to achieve. Still on Ill Bliss. The rapper also spoke on the downsides of brand endorsements in Nigeria. Um, the downside of it is, you know, the way it works in Nigeria is almost some sort of like a silent war. You know, like if you're on this side and I can't, I can't work with you. If I'm a comedian, for instance, and endorsed by another brand and another comedian is having a show, I can't go, I can't support them, I can't be on their carpet. Um, the artist can't even seem to collaborate freely. You know, because they are thinking, oh, he's a glue ambassador. When we do videos, are you sure my people from the brand side won't be upset? You know, so altogether, I think it's brought some value, you know, and um, it's also brought some, it stifles the, the, the unity that can be, that, that is needed in the industry. Lord knows I'm a non-stop spender, but of all bosses, illy traffic, I say what? 